We want to get to some stories now that we're following from all across Metro Detroit this morning. And those stories include Wixom and Warren, but we do want to get you updated on a story out of Westland this morning where a judge says that there is not enough evidence to charge a former Westland police officer and two paramedics with manslaughter. William Marshall died in police custody back in 2017 when he went into convulsions inside of his cell. However, all three will stand trial on charges of misconduct in office. And over to Warren now, thieves led police on a high speed chase Tuesday morning after breaking into this Metro PCS store. Police were alerted after a business owner noticed the men next door breaking into that business. Well, the suspects allegedly broke into a Boost Mobile store first on Mound Road at Sterling Heights. The two were arrested after that chase, but police are still searching for a third person. Over in Wixom, an elementary school teacher was honored for how she reacted to an emergency at her school. The city honored Laura Doran for her fast thinking that saved eight year old Sienna Cavanaugh last Tuesday. Sienna accidentally swallowed a bottle cap from her water bottle during lunchtime and was choking at Loon Lake Elementary School. Doran started the Heimlich maneuver and the cap came flying out. Sienna's parents, as you can imagine, are extremely grateful. We are forever, forever in her debt. There's no way we could ever repay her. And that's the one thing I would apologize for is I can't, I can never repay her for what she is, what she has done for us. She is pretty remarkable. Mrs. Doran says that she loves all of her students and has an additional reminder for them. Please don't chew on any bottle caps.